Hello everyone, welcome to our final Build Awards Day, presented by our marketing partner Rogers. Across these past three days, I hope you have all enjoyed seeing the exceptional work done by Build members. I am tremendously proud of the great work done by our industry and partners as we work together to build a better GTA. From the branding and marketing, to the design of the spaces where we live and feel safe, to the large master plan communities that create our neighborhoods, our industry continues to showcase its creativity, innovation and strength as Ontario's economic engine. Congratulations to all of yesterday's finalists and winners, most notably our sales team of the year, both for High and Low Rise, International Home Marketing Group, Best High Rise Building Design, Tridel at the Well by Tridel, Best Community Built, The Residences of College Park by Canderell Management, Best New Community, Planned or Under Development, Brightwater by Diamond Corp, Dream Asset Management, Fram Building Group, and Kilmer Van Nostrand. Supported by Innovative Design by Bertie Fleck, Ciccone Simoni, Urban Tech Consulting, and Hunt Design Associates. All of these projects and more are supported by hundreds of professionals passionate about the industry, including our agencies which help sell these communities. The Brand Factory, Gladstone, Pure Blink, Montana Steel, Ryan Design, Guidelines Advertising, among many, many others. I look forward to seeing our finalists and winners today and all of you soon in person. Don't forget you can visit the showcase to learn more about our sponsors. Thank you to our production partner Memory Tree for their fantastic work across this entire week bringing you the Build Awards in the comfort of your homes. Thank you all for joining us, and as always, don't forget to tag all your posts with hashtag BuildAwardsGTA. Welcome to the final day of Build Awards Week, day four of Awards Live, streamed to you courtesy of Rogers. Build thanks all of our award sponsors, finalists, and winners for joining us during the week, and you, our members, for tuning in each day for the presentation of all awards finalists and winners. To kick off our final day, we have a special presentation from Build Chair Cheryl Shindrick and Build President Dave Wilkes to this year's recipient of the Stephen Dupuis CSR Award. The next award is a very special award for the industry and for BUILD. Not only is it a pinnacle award, but it is an award presented in the name and honour of our past CEO, Stephen Dupuis. It is my great pleasure to welcome Cheryl Shindrick, Chair of BUILD and Executive Vice President for Geranium, to help me present the prestigious Stephen Dupuis Corporate Social Responsibility the Stephen Dupuy Corporate Social Responsibility Award is one of BUILD's highest recognitions. The award is presented to a member company or individual committed to corporate social responsibility and recognizes their efforts in enhancing the industry's reputation. Companies dedicated to CSR are conscious of the kind of impact they are having on all aspects of society. Stephen Dupuy, who passed away in 2011, championed many of BUILD's charitable community partnerships and our commitment to supporting the communities in which we live. The company receiving today's award was founded on a unique private and government collaboration. It has a well-developed corporate social responsibility program that stretches across community, youth, philanthropy and the environment. This company believes that corporate social responsibility is not just the right thing to do, it is an essential part of the company's role as a community builder. This year's recipient has a commitment to the environment that includes more than 20 buildings that have achieved various levels of LEED certification and four residential buildings that have achieved Tier 2 Toronto Green Standards certification. They have demonstrated environmental leadership 
with an ambitious framework to reduce greenhouse gas emissions and with disclosure of water and energy uses and carbon emissions across all their properties as part of the 2019 Canadian Green Building Council Disclosure Challenge. In addition, this company has many initiatives that integrate both youth and community. In order to support homeless youth, 88 staff slept in the cold in two cities to raise $110,000 for Covenant House. In addition, through staff volunteerism and corporate donation, this organization supports youth without shelter, including over $200,000 in donations over the last four years. Our recipient today also worked for over 25 years with industry partners to support trades training that prepares graduates for rewarding careers. And this is done whether through raising funds for the program or direct pledges to colleges. These are just some of the highlights that also include involvement with the Ride to Conquer Cancer, Sick Kids Hospitals, and countless food and clothing drives. I am so pleased to announce that today's recipient of the Stephen Dupuy Corporate Social Responsibility Award is Concert Properties. First of all, thank you. It's an incredible honour to work for a company that is truly committed to social consciousness. We, all of our colleagues across the country, truly believe in giving back to our communities, giving back to our industry, and reducing our environmental footprint. We're truly honoured to be bestowed this great award, the Stephen Dupuy Award for Corporate Social Responsibility. We want to thank our peers, we want to thank the Build team, and we want to thank the awards judges for honouring us with this award. On behalf of all of our colleagues across the country, thank you. We will now announce the finalists and winners for our final set of marketing awards. Best Project Branding and Identity Mid High Rise, presented by gold sponsor GE Appliances Jason Fuku. Regional Sales Manager for Canada. Capital Developments, Metropia and Rio Can Real Estate Investment Trust, 11 Yorkville Condos, Montana Steel Advertising. Elad Canada Realty. Galleria on the Park, The Brand Factory, U31, Core Architects. Lanterra Developments, Number 31 Condominiums, Montana Steel Advertising. Reserve Properties and Westdale Properties. Untitled, Toronto, Gladstone Media. On behalf of GE Appliances, we would like to congratulate all of the award winners this year. Without further ado, the award goes to Lanterra Developments, number 31 condominiums, Montana Steel Advertising. Congratulations.
Best Brochure, Mid High Rise, presented by Paolo Pede, new home sales manager of Spectrum Realty, a silver sponsor. Capital Developments, Metropia, and Rio Can Real Estate Investment Trust. 11 Yorkville Condos, Montana Steel Advertising. Lanterra Developments, number 31 Condominiums, Montana Steel Advertising. Minto Communities, 123 Portland, U31. And the award for best brochure mid high rise goes to Lantera Developments. Number 31 condominiums, Montana Steel Advertising. From all of us at Spectrum Sky and Spectrum Realty, Joe, Renee, Andy, Montana Steel, congratulations on your build awards. Thanks, Paolo. It's a, it's a great honor. Thank you very much. Best website. Presented by Stacy Kirk of Maple Ridge Community Management, a new Silver Award sponsor. Acorn Developments, Look Out on the Knoll, Gladstone Media. Empire Communities, Empire Life Reimagined, Pure Blink. Tribute Communities, Young and Sedan, Guidelines Advertising. Hello everyone, I'm here to present the Build's Annual Award for Best Website. And the winner is Acorn Developments, Lookout on the Knoll, Gladstone Media. Congratulations. Great job. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Our next set of awards focuses on engaging the public in new ways. Best Experiential Marketing Campaign, presented by Lydia Dadek and Natasha Rubin Copeland for Gold Award Sponsor, TD. Brookfield Residential, Dockside in Whitby, Kool-Aid Studios. Capital Developments, Metropia, and Rio Can Real Estate Investment Trust. 11 Yorkville Condos, Montana Steel Advertising. Rosehaven Homes, Kiwi Condos, McCuit Partnership. On behalf of TD Canada Trust, we'd like to congratulate all of this year's nominees and winners. And the winner is... For Best Experimental Marketing Campaign, congratulations, Capital Developments, Metropia, and Real Can Real Estate Investment Trust, 11 Yorkville Condos, Montana Steel Advertising. Congrats.
Best Organic Social Campaign is sponsored by Next Home, a new gold sponsor. Presented by Jackie Hill, Chief Revenue Officer. Acorn Developments, look out on the knoll. Gladstone Media. Great Gulf Homes, Corporate Campaign, Montana Steel Advertising. Reserve Properties and Westdale Properties, Untitled, Toronto, Gladstone Media. Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to my home office here in Thornhill, where on behalf of the Next Home Group, Homes Magazine and Condo Life, I'd like to firstly congratulate all of the finalists for the best organic social campaign and announce today's winner. Drum roll, please. Reserve Properties and Westdale Properties, Untitled Toronto, Gladstone Media. Once again, congratulations to all and have a great afternoon. We will now move on to our Pinnacle Awards. Best Advertising Campaign, Paid Media, presented by Platinum Sponsor, Hunter Milborn, President and CEO of Milborn Realty Group. Capital Developments, Metropia, and Rio Can Real Estate Investment Trust. 11 Yorkville Condos, Baker Real Estate Incorporated, Ciccone Simone, Montana Steel Advertising, Chestnut Hill Developments, Universal City Condos, Tower 3, Intuition Realty, Montana Steel Advertising, Great Gulf Homes, Great Gulf Whitby Meadows, Montana Steel Advertising, The United Building, LA Inc. And the award goes to Great Gulf Homes, Great Gulf Whitby Meadows, Montana Steel Advertising. Congratulations, gang. Fantastic. So it's with great pleasure that I present to Great Golf the Best Advertising Campaign Award. Thank you. Thank you. It gives me great pleasure to present this award to Montana Steel, a long established company in the marketing and advertising component of Toronto's real estate. I'm not the best person to, to give you this award. <laughs> Hunter Milborn that I've known for... And worked together for how many years? You won't tell. You won't say. Best Overall Marketing Campaign Presented by Debbie Kosick, CEO of Intuition Realty A gold sponsor Aspen Ridge Homes, Crosstown, The Brand Factory. (music) 
Empire Communities, Empire Life Reimagined, Pure Blink. Reserve Properties and Westdale Properties, Untitled, Toronto, Gladstone Media, KG&A. The United Building, LA Inc. I'm the CEO of Intuition Realty. I'm honored to be here today on behalf of my team at Intuition Realty to be presenting the award for best overall marketing campaign. And that award goes to Empire Communities for Empire Life Reimagined and Pure Bling. Congratulations. On behalf of Intuition Realty, I'd like to present you with this award for best overall marketing campaign for Empire Communities. Congratulations. Thank you. I wish you could see my smile. <laughs> we are thrilled to be the recipient of the best overall marketing campaign. I want to thank our team. What an awesome job, Mike, our marketing director, and Dan, our EVP of sales. Um, we're really excited. It's, it's an honor to be awarded with such a pinnacle um, acknowledgement. So thank you to Build, and, and thanks to our entire team. Hey, we're very happy to receive this award. This campaign was centered in those small but very meaningful emotions of owning a small town. And we are very thankful to the Empire Marketing team for believing in this idea and making it happen. Thank you so much. Next is People's Choice Award. Presented by Janine Keeble, Builder Sales Manager for Cosentino, a new Platinum Award sponsor. Acorn Developments, Lookout on the Knoll, Gladstone Media, GCB Interior Architecture. Collective, Treddy, Montana Steel Advertising. Metropia and Context Development, New Lawrence Heights, Guidelines Advertising. <music> Pace Developments, Urban North, RN Design, Engine Communication. Tridell, Tridell at the Well, Diamond Corp, Rio Can Real Estate Investment Trust, 2x4 Design, the MBTW Group W Architect, The Brand Factory. In fifth place, Pace Developments, Project Urban North, RN Design and Engine Communications. In fourth place, Collect Dev, Project Treti, Montana Steel Advertising. In third place, Tridel, the project Tridel at the Well, Diamond Luxury Developments Corp, Rio Can Re Real Estate Investment Trust, 2x4 Design, the MBTW Group, 
W Architect Inc. and The Brand Factory. In second place, Metropia and Context Development Inc. Project New Lawrence Heights, Guidelines Advertising Inc. And the winner of the People Choice Award is Acon Developments for the Project Lookout on the Knoll, Gladstone Media, GCB Interior Architect Inc. Congratulations to all for a job well done. Um, it was great pleasure this morning that I'm here to present the People's Choice Award to Acorn Developments. So, congratulations, well done, and looking forward to working with you. Our final award is for Home Builder of the Year, Mid High Rise. Presented by Rich Young of Rogers, a build marketing partner. Collective. Great Gulf Homes. Yeah. Tribute Community. Tridel. And the award goes to Great Golf Homes. Congratulations to all the finalists and winners today and throughout this week. Remember to celebrate your achievements by using hashtag BuildAwardsGTA. And thank you to our 39 awards judges who helped select our finalists and winners this year. Once again, our thanks to our award sponsors for their support and all our members for celebrating the Build Awards online with us this week.